the humanitarian crisis and looming terrible fire conditions have prompted a 24-hour race against time to move thousands of people from the NSW South Coast as authorities in Victoria said 17 people were still missing in the horror start to the year. As people began to flee the area this morning the roads were clogged with traffic, with Transport Minister Andrew Constance calling it the largest relocation out of the region ever. About 50,000 homes are without power, phone networks are down, fuel is running low, major supermarkets are closed and people are queuing for up to three hours to get food. We cannot overstate the potential risk of more damage and more destruction. RFS Commissioner Shane Fitzsimmons said, There is a big effort between today and tomorrow to get as many people out of the south coast as we can. Kosciuszko National Park has been evacuated with everyone ordered out by 10 a.m. tomorrow ahead of Saturday's predicted firestorm. This is an essential measure to protect life, national parks and wildlife has warned. Bushfires in Victoria also continue to burn, with the number of people missing in the state increasing to 17. Premier Daniel Andrews said the missing 17 are residents, not firefighters. They may have been trying to defend their homes, he said. More than 45 fires are still burning in East Gippsland and in the state's northeast around Corrying, testing more than 1,000 firefighters on the front line. Three of the East Gippsland blazes have combined to form one massive firefront 150 kilometers wide. 